Hey, so this is the webcam robot I built. You might be familiar with this robot because it's from the other DIY hacking tutorial where you can use your smartphone to control a small robot via Bluetooth. So I've just basically used the same robot and uh, hooked it up to a Raspberry Pi and a USB webcam so that I'll be able to see the live feed from this webcam while the robot is moving. So it can be used for surveillance and other cool stuff. So it basically has uh, an Arduino on the bottom from the old tutorial and a Raspberry Pi on top along with the webcam. I also have a Wi-Fi dongle to uh, transmit the feed via Wi-Fi. Now I'll just show you how this works. Okay, so you have two things here. One is a smartphone which is used to control the robot. It's just the same thing which you will be seeing in the other tutorial. Uh, from DIYhacking.com and then you have uh, an iPad showing the webcam feed so basically there's this HTML file running you can open the HTML file on the iPad using a file manager and it has a small uh, set of code which uh, is directed towards the Raspberry Pi's IP address and its port uh, on which the video is being broadcasted so I've just used that so it's showing the feed from the robot in real time have the robot here so I'll just show you uh, the movement of the robot and the corresponding feed so when I press front robot moves front you can see the feed changing when I uh, press right the robot turns right you can see uh, the feed changes correspondingly so you can do a whole lot of cool stuff with this you can use it for pranks, spying on people, and other wicked stuff too. Huh? So, yeah, it's a very simple robot. And it comes in handy. You can use it for surveillance, and a lot of other stuff too. If you want to build this robot, you can just refer to the other tutorial I have on the smartphone control robot on the same side so it's pretty responsive to the video it's there's just only a very little delay while transmission So that's about it. It's a really cool project you can do. You just need a couple of things and just check out the instructions at DIYhacking.com and have fun with this robot.